hello cancer this is y'all late night vibes reading okay um just pretty much what's going on what spirit got to say with y'all this late night all right this is a general reading so if it does not resonate you know that just means it was meant for somebody else that message was somebody else's message if you want to apply let it fly okay um with that being said also fuck the rose is me be so if i'm saying it's you and it's your person or vice versa or he's a she she's a he flip it how you need to flip it okay all right perfect so i'm playing music we on our breath fires chop this screw tonight for these late night vibes <clears throat> but spirit guides ancestors universe help me channel my cancer collective energy this late night what is going on with my cancer Pinnacles gonna left out the hierophant. Okay. Ooh, this is this is heavy. All right. Well, spirit guides, ancestors, universe. Can we clarify this three of swords? Let's see what's going on with this three of swords. Three of Cups. Okay, yeah. So, you guys could be heartbroken. Okay. Three Swords, Heartbreak, right? That's what's on y'all mind this late night. So, somebody broke your heart. There was some cheating, some lying, some deceit because we have Three of Swords, but then you clarified yourself with the Three of Cups. That's the first part that came out. So, it was definitely a third party situation. So, somebody was cheating. Um, for show for show communicating with somebody that was supposed to communicate with me up linking with somebody that was supposed to be linked with um if you found out but there is justice that is being brought to this situation so that could be how you found out um and this person lost you but <clears throat> um could be some legal matters involved in this as well which could be the reason that they even mingling with this person because they could have some type of issues that they're trying to like settle over before it gets too big and like they didn't want you or nobody to find out about it so they was trying to talk to this person again to like keep keep whatever karma coming their way from coming their way but karma's gonna do what this got to be but yeah but justice is being served to whoever this person is that's in the wrong here. Because they have you in the four swords energy. Okay, this is literally you. Just up at night, sitting there, just rejuvenating, chilling to yourself. Because it's like, this was your person. This is who you were spending most of your time with. And now you ain't got them. It's like you had lost yourself in this connection. This person had you feeling left out in the cold. Do you see how it was like? inside the church it's some stuff going on but they can't even see they not there where's the door they just outside in the snow in the cold somebody got crutches like this is girl why is nobody helping them why does nobody care your feelings are hurt by whatever this person i'm not laughing at y'all by whatever um took place betrayal heartbreak cheating lies that took place so can we clarify this kind of pickles? Egg swords, king of wands, and the queen of cups. Okay, give me a second because this is my part. So it could feel like you were left out. But little did you know, you were being pushed out of this. 
because there is some there is another path for you like you are meant to bloom and shine and you feel me be all prosperous and abundant and this person got some bullshit going on with somebody else and they was trying to like protect your feelings low key but but like they still hurt your thoughts because they still had you wrapped up in it in the first place and had this other person there in the first place and it's like they should have been your period um hold on my back is killing me yeah because it pushed you into this single happy energy though um you are now becoming more emotionally in tune and balanced when the cups because this person ate a sword they felt stuck in between like a rock and a hard place so that's why they had i'm not making that excuse for them but that's why they was balancing or trying to juggle you and this other person because they felt like they had to they felt like they, they genuinely felt like they had no choice like you know they did but you know that's how they this is how they feel um like confusion they don't know what to choose what to do because it's like they have some type of karma legal shit going on with this person um but they want you like they want a new beginning with you king of want yeah because they're very passionate fiery um this person could have been a very fun impulsive energy but so they know how to do the, the charm you know like the sweet talking all that good stuff but yeah no because you now your queen of cups energy you know what is um what to emotionally invest yourself in and what not to and you're very empathetic when it comes to this person or maybe when it comes to people period now you're stepping more into your life your energy of who you truly are and you're learning that you are like an empath like you absorb other people's energy and like you take on their shit <laughs> that's what i just heard this person was a burden though like this was a blessing in disguise uh, the high response Can we clarify the higher spot? Spirit! <laughs> Wish fulfillment. Six of Pentacles. So. After taking some time with yourself, getting back right with you, getting spiritually in tune with yourself, spiritually connected with nature and from you, um, your manifestations, you're more focused on manifesting things now or getting to your wish fulfillment because balance, oh shit, balance has now been brought to your life. I feel like you're focused on giving back to the community somehow, some way. And you're just sitting back, watching, wait. Well, there's some type of seeds you planted. Something you were manifesting. You did the work behind it. But you did the work without ex like expecting something in return. And because of that, you're going to get what you want. Just be patient, sit back, and wait. Because you've already done the action for it. But I mean, keep working hard and shit. I ain't saying just give up now that you done did something. Like, keep working on it type shit. But I'm saying don't stress it. Don't like put too much attention to it. Don't like overdo it type shit. Period. What other messages do you have for the cancers? Messages for my cancer. Yeah, see, your soulmate is not the fruit, it is the seed. Yeah, you and this person were too much, like, not alike. Hella differences going on. Um, oh, 
I don't know why I just whatever. I don't know if that was somebody needed to hear that part of the song, but Spirit told me to shut up and then let that ride real quick. So they said they know they leaving whether there's reason or not. They're trying to give them reasons to stop. Oh anyways, see your soulmate is not the fruit. You were putting so much happiness and like care into this person thinking that they was your wish fulfillment when it's like no. A relationship should only help you progress you in life like your relationship should not be the only thing that you are worried about your relationship should help you progress yourself as an individual as well like you should still be growing individually inside of a relationship um this person you and this person have the same goals but y'all wasn't on the same page as far as how to get there because as you can see they had some whole other shit going on that they was invested in and you was invested into them and y'all wasn't on the same page. <laughs> what do your person got to say? Let me pass the person I have to say. Late night vibes. I wish I could take back my words. That's her lies. Um, I feel like you feel like this person is a liar. <laughs> no matter what they say, it's like you can't really see them the same anymore. It's sort of like when they say they wish they could take back their words or them coming back to you with some type of apology, it's like you don't even believe it because maybe this person was like a reoccurring problem in the relationship and finally you've had enough and found out something um or they might have chose this person and went with this person but the thing is though they like their heart is with you so you probably feel left out feel like oh whatever because like we gotta can't stop thinking about you even though you're with this other person and my life is not as together as it seems yeah they're with this person to figure out some type of justice some type of legal situation they are not in some type of trouble some type of karma they're not trying to serve but it's gonna be served regardless um so don't even worry about that relationship because that shit ain't even real that shit ain't shit on shit okay that's what i have to tell you that shit on shit um 